think we can all agree that it's hard to multitask or master a particular craft. But what if I told you about a guy that's not only mastered one craft, but two? I'm here with Nicholas Powell. And what school are you going to? Delta University. And you're playing what sport? Football. All right, we'll get back into that in a second. Yes, Let's sir, talk yes, about sir. why you chose about the university. Out of all the schools that offered me, that was the greatest opportunity. Plus, it's close to home, so that's my best choice, I, I feel like. All right, and when did you start playing football? I started playing football when I was about 10 years old in the county league. Yeah, yes, 10 years old. And I got to say this, man, because I got to toot your horn, right? I ain't never seen somebody play football as aggressive as you, man. So where, where does that come from, that aggression, when you get on the field and you make plays like that? Watching football over the years with Ray Lewis, my uncles, all the people I look up to, they all play aggressive football, physical football, and I was like, that's the, that's the main point of the game, aggressive and physical. Right, right, and, and that's how you approach it every that's time? That's how I approach it every time. You're a student athlete. What does that word mean to you? Student athlete, you're a student before athlete. You got to perform well in the classroom before you get to perform well on the field. Man, and you've done a lot of great things here at Southside. We were just talking a little bit off camera, some stuff that you want to get accomplished and whatnot, man. So what would you say your biggest memory from here so far, just going to school here and playing on the field? Uh, I say the biggest memory is when I joined theater. Okay, and I did okay. my first show. Yeah, it was actually crazy. I, I, I wasn't expecting to turn out as well as I did, but it turned out pretty well. So wait, wait, you do some acting as well? Yeah. You got to tell me about that. Where did that come from? What made you want to join theater and start doing acting? Uh, Miss Cargill, she walked up. She walked up to me and she was like, "Every year we um, we get a football player, a star football player, to do the show." And she, I guess, she just chose me and she encouraged me. She kept encouraging me to do it. So I was like, "It's something different." So I guess I'll try. You know. You think there's something you continue to do, like maybe improv classes or something like that? Even when you I go to bed by improv, <laughs> I might do a couple other shows. Okay, yeah, okay. Yeah. I gotta ask you this, man, because you're a great young man. Who inspires you? Is it somebody in your family, somebody professionally? But who inspires you every morning you get up to push yourself? My entire family, because my entire family, they put, they motivate me to get up every day. They get up every day, they work hard. My nana's right here, she, she get up work every day hard. My uncle D-Berry, my mom, all my uncles, they just hard workers, family full of hard workers. That's what our legacy is built on, hard workers, so gotta keep the hard work hard going. Hard work is so important, man, it's it really is. Play. Let's talk about, there's another little Nicholas Powell out there, right? He's looking at you, he's like, man, that guy's great on the field, he can do acting, he can do everything. Right. What advice would you give to him? I say effort. Effort is believe you. It would take you so far. I mean, you might not have the best talent. You might not be the fastest. You might not be the strongest. But if you put forth the effort, it, it's gonna it's gonna show. It's gonna show. They know who I am, so it's not it's not really much to hide. So. Oh, I do sing. You sing. I do sing. I am in the choir. You got vocals. Well. Okay. All right. Shout out to me. Yeah. Say you sing I as well. Sing as well. I'm in the choir as okay. well. Okay. So. I ain't gonna put you on the spot. Hey, <laughs> I, 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 I ain't gonna do it like that. Like but that's like how like you got anything else for me? Um, I just want to thank everyone for the love and the support. You know, it's been it's been great getting to do what I've been able to do in the past four years. I can say it's a true blessing from God. Definitely, man. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. No problem. No problem. Well done. As you can see, Nick is a great kid with a lot of great qualities, and the sky's the limit for whatever he puts his mind to. For the full interview, head online to WBBJTV.com.